Hi there, this is Laura, interning for Good Fellow Occupational Therapy, and today we're gonna play some fun games. And we're gonna start with looking for ants and, find, and bringing them back to the ant hole. So for this game, all we need is a brown paper bag you can find. Make a little cut at the top with scissors, parents, for your little ant hole. Another thing for this activity that you can use is just a regular piece of paper, for example, and fold it up to look like a little ant hill. So I just stapled a piece of paper together. Or if you don't have access to paper, I also um, used a cup and you could write the words ant hill on that. Um, if you need to or just practice using a cup to place things in We're also going to be using some tongs And here I'm going to do a close-up of how my hand should look you can open your hand like this Okay, kind of like a duck opens her mouth and make sure you place the tongs in between the web space so the thumb is going to be on one side and the index and middle finger is going to be on the other side. And this helps develop those muscles for um, completing a tripod grasp. And that's the type of grasp that you're going to use for writing. So making sure that the tongs are placed in your hand like this. Okay, so we're going to grab and look for those ants around the table. I have some raisins here. And what we're gonna do is we're gonna spread out these raisins all around the table and practice finding our little ants and bringing them back to the ant hole. You can also try picking up things that are a little bigger than almonds or or raisins like almonds for example so we can try alternating um, these types of objects to be picked up because they're different sizes with their tops so go ahead and grab a handful sprinkle them around and close your eyes and we're gonna pick up our ant scooper tongs we're going to practice finding some ants. Do you see an ant on the table? I do. Pick that ant up. Try to get it with the tongs. There it is. Now let's bring this. We're going to put it back in here, right down into the ant hole. Drop. That was fun. Are you ready to do another one? Looking for ants. I see one right there. Open your tongue, squeeze it, try to pick it up, bring it back into this ant hole. There we go. Now we're gonna start with our next activity. Today for snack, we're gonna be making ants on a log. Yay! So what are the things we're gonna be using today for our snack? We're gonna have raisins. So a nice big handful of raisins. We're going to be using peanut butter. Mmm, <gasps> I love peanut butter, yummy. And we're gonna be using celery. Yay, celery, healthy, healthy vegetable. So, we're gonna make sure we have our celery on our plate. We're gonna get our handful of raisins on our napkin. Let's pick up our napkin and we're gonna place our raisins right there. Okay, now we got our celery and we have our raisins on our plate. Now we're gonna get our peanut butter. So let's open our peanut butter. Are you ready? Grab your peanut butter. 
Let's twist the top. One, two, three. Twist, 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 twist. Let's do it a few more times. Twist, it came off. Okay. Now we're going to open the peanut butter. Pinch, and we're going to take off the lid. There we go. Now we're going to grab our knife. Do you have your knife? Let's be careful. We know to hold the handle down here. So we're holding the handle here and the sharp part goes on the inside. Now we're going to scoop some peanut butter. Okay, so grab your knife with one hand and we're gonna do one scoop, one big scoop like this, okay? Make sure you get it on the top. Now we're going to spread our big scoop of peanut butter by holding on to our celery. So let's hold our celery right here and we're gonna spread the peanut butter. Ready? Let's start down here. Spread, 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 all the way down. Spread, 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 spread. Try to get the peanut butter on the inside of the celery. Good job. Oh no, it looks like some of my peanut butter went under the celery stick. So let's get our knife and we're going to pick that peanut butter up off of the side. I turned the celery over so I could scoop that peanut butter. So now that peanut butter is back. Let's spread, spread, spread. Spread the peanut butter. Spread it towards you. How are you doing? Did you spread that peanut butter on the celery? Okay, let's try one more spread. Making sure that peanut butter is smooth. Spread, spread, spread. Spread the peanut butter down. There we go. Nice and smooth. It looks like I got more peanut butter on the side. So I'm gonna pick that up. We're gonna push it towards the other peanut butter on the top. Spread, spread, spread. Spread, spread, spread. Okay, so we finished getting our peanut butter spread all the way to the top. So now we're gonna get our raisins. Are you ready? Let's put our knife down. And we're gonna get our raisins. That is tasty. We need to wipe our hands before, just in case you got any peanut butter on your hands. So you can grab a napkin and make sure you wipe your hand off. There's some peanut butter on my finger. I need to wipe that off. That is messy. There's some peanut butter right here. I'm gonna wipe that off. Wipe, wipe, wipe on my thumb too. Wipe, wipe, wipe. All right. Okay, now we're gonna put raisins on our celery. Are you ready? Pinch one raisin. Let's put one raisin on the celery. One raisin goes right there. Another raisin. We're gonna put that one on the celery, on the peanut butter, right there. So now I have two ants on my peanut butter on my celery log. Let's get another raisin. Pick it up. We're gonna put this raisin right here. Now I have three ants on my peanut butter log. All right, let's do three more. Pick up a raisin. 
Oops, pick up a raisin, put it on the log. Now I have one, two, three, four. I think we have time for two more. Pick up another raisin, put it on the log. Okay, one more time for a raisin. Here we go, one more. We're gonna put it on the log. Okay, so we got all our raisins on our log. Look at all those little ants in our log. Let's take one big bite. Mmm. Do you like your ants on your log? This is so tasty. Wow. Okay, so we're done making a snack. Now we're gonna practice writing some letters. So today we're gonna focus on writing the letter A. Yay, letter A. So I'm gonna make a big box on my whiteboard or piece of paper. So here is my box. Okay, we're gonna start at the top of the box up here. And we're gonna make one line down to the corner. You try it. Remember to start at the top. Make your line all the way down to this corner. We're going to make our second line. Are you ready? So I'm gonna start all the way at the top and come down all the way to this corner. There we go, your turn. Remember to start all the way at the top and come all the way down to this corner. Okay, now we're gonna make our middle line. Start right here. You're gonna cross it all the way across right there. Your turn. Start right here and go all the way across. And now you've made the letter A. A for ant. Good job this week. We'll see you next time. Bye.